Yes, I'm back. <clears throat> and right now I'm talking about T.I. Shout out to brother T.I. For G-checking Lil Wayne's coon ass. Uh, he checked Mayweather's remedial coon ass too. A lot of people had mixed feelings about that. Saying oh he only did that because they had some sort of um, disagreement over... Um, Picture or some sort that was taken with uh, T.I.'s wife, Tiny. But articles in the description, I'm just reading to you what he said. He said, I am uh, at a complete loss of words here. There's rapper T.I. addresses Lil Wayne in the new Instagram post inspired by controversial comments Wayne received made about how he doesn't feel connected to the BLM movement. I know you wired a little bit different than most out and most other responsible adults, but you still tripping. T.I. writes, I don't know that, I don't know what you're going through or what you are attempting to avoid, but this is absolutely unacceptable. You're disrespecting yourself, bringing shame on your family name, and tarnishing your legacy. Wayne caused an uproar last week in an interview on Puss Ass ABC's Nightline, in which he was asked about how his thoughts on the Black Lives Matter and this protest of police killing uh, African Americans. I don't feel connected to a damn thing. They ain't going to do nothing to, to, with me. If you do, you crazy. Wayne later clarified the comments on TZ. He got agitated when Nightline Report asked a question about his daughter being called vulgar names. You see, uh, someone told me that too, but. Still not buying it, and at the same time, Wayne, you are upset because someone I was hearing that she might have put it put his daughter in a category uh, as a bitch or or a hoe. But for Wayne, for the past fifteen to twenty years, all you've been rapping about is how yo yo bitch this, yo hoe that. You've been calling Melanoid women hoes and bitches for twenty years. So what do you expect? She probably calls herself that. I'm sure her uh, boyfriends or whatever listen to you. So they're going to call her that. So you getting upset at that, you shouldn't have set the wrong example of Melanoid women to downgrade themselves to be called bitches and hoes. It is, you, don't even, you don't even like being black. You know, you probably don't even like your daughter being that dark. Because I heard in the one song you said, uh, that bitch black, but she be better red. Light skin supremacy. Another problem Melanoid people have that we don't like to address. We have a problem with being black. We hate being black. Collectively. But I digress because I already did a video on that. And continue. From there, there was no thought but... Excuse me. From there, there was no thought put into her question. In my response, he said, apologizes to anyone who was offended. Bullshit. For T.I., though, that was clearly not enough. Framing his lengthy comments on a personal appeal to close friend. Our daughters grew up together. He writes, the rapper confronted Wayne directly. Bro, if you don't stand for something out here, all the money, jewelry, cars, mansion, bandanas, and hit records don't mean shit. He writes using a stronger word. Well, they wrote it don't mean nothing, but I'm saying what he really said. Our people are being oppressed. We are being hunted, captured, and slaughtered out here daily. You have to get out of that bubble that you've been living in. Get out here and educate yourself on what's going on around us. T.I. goes on to offer to share whatever knowledge or understanding I may have to assist your growth and development. The warns waiting to stop this buffoonery. The anti said coonery. They didn't put that in. And... You <clears throat> that you're doing it. You looking like somebody who has something to gain or lose by pretending like it's not as bad as Black Lives Matter makes it seem. You're not aware of any issue that needs to be addressed. Now he's aware. Wayne, he knows what's up. He's just consciously cooning, which I have a problem with. And if you're doing that, you're going to be a part of the coon train. At least my coon train. The rapper says he's been proud to call myself fan, friend of Lil Wayne, but if this must end in order to stand up for those who can do it, 
themselves, so be it. He's been asked, Dean Wayne, to stop embarrassing yourself. Everyone out here who's been supporting you, there is no middle around ground. Oppression knows no neutral party. Either you're part of the oppressed or you with the oppressor. There is no such thing as oppression not affecting you. That is a fact. Yeah, I support Brother T.I. I mean, people been trying to clown him like, oh, T.I. think he are Malcolm X. No, he's just conscious and he knows what we're up against, which a lot of Illinois people, unfortunately, globally don't know. And uh, T.I.'s, I mean, excuse me, Wayne's daughter, his oldest, she had a problem with T.I. talking about, you look like you want attention. You could have texted him or called him. You got his number. You could have just did that behind the scenes. I thought about it. <clears throat> at at one hand, I agree. But then again, I don't because he didn't make them coon-ass comments privately. He went on a major platform, a white supremacy platform, and spewed that ignorant-ass rhetoric. So fuck that. T.I., I don't feel I don't feel like he wants attention. I feel like he did what anyone else would have done as a Melanoid person, especially in America, who was upset with the way our people have been treated for the past four hundred years and counting. And then you hear some coon ass nigga like Wayne, who's cooning for massive buck dancing because he's trying to get a check because he knows his clout is dying. No one's checking for his poop ass music no more. He needs that 50 million bird man Sandusky to, uh, robbed him for. It. So he's cooning it up. But I applaud T.I. for G-checking Wayne. Say what you want. He, uh, but he did, uh, he did what was right. He stood up for the voices that are unheard. Like mine and, and others. But uh, let me know what y'all think about this. Think T.I. was right? You think he wants attention? You think he could have did this uh, directly, called Wayne, and not made it uh, public for everyone to see? In the comments, like, subscribe, share the video.